We're closed. But you can come back tomorrow. If you need a ride home, the place next door will. Oh, it's you. Come on in. It's fine. I was just cleaning around. Come sit. And I'll put some coffee on. So, what brings you to my lovely bar so late at night? Did you just get off work and need a drink? Or did you just miss me too much? <laughs> Oh, you came to see me for some advice. If it's about running a bar, putting some furniture together, <laughs> or changing a tire, I can help you out with that. Relationship advice. Well, I'm not exactly some dating genius. <laughs> I think you can figure that out by the state of my love life. Oh, ha ha. At this rate, all you'll get is being over my knee. <laughs> so, who's the guy? Oh, come on. You can tell me. I promise not to hate him instantly. Oh god. It's not that guy you work with. Is it? Good. Because you can do so much better. No need to lower yourself to someone else's standards. Just because they can't raise their own. I've dated some losers in my time. They all say the same nice stuff at the beginning to get you hooked. And then they start to push boundaries. They'll start small at first. And if they feel any kind of resistance, they'll make out that you're overreacting. I want better for you. <laughs> I know, I know. I worry too much. Here, let me get us some coffee. You still like it the same way as always, right? Good. Yeah. You know that coffee keeps me going. <laughs> Especially working night shift. <sighs> Here you go. You should bring this guy you like down to the bar sometime. I am a pretty good judge of character. If there's anything wrong with him, I'll figure it out pretty quick. So protective of him. Alright, alright. I won't push for more information. But you did come down here for advice. It must be pretty serious if you waited until the bar closed to ask me anything. So ask away. You're scared to tell him that you like him because you don't want to ruin your friendship with him. Ah, I get it. I've once or twice been in your shoes. But what I will say is you just tell him. Being in the limbo, wondering if it's the right decision or not, <laughs> it will tear you up inside far worse than whether he says yes or no. Let's say 
For instance, he does reject you. At least you can sleep better at night knowing the answer. And if he gets all weird because of it, <laughs> good riddance. Anyone would be flattered to have someone so incredible asking them out. You're good looking, you're smart, and you're fun to be around. What more could a guy want? If he's known you all this time and hasn't fallen head over heels in love with you, the man has no taste. <laughs> I'm not just saying that because I'm your friend. I'm saying it because it's true. You've never seemed to mind all my quirks, and there are a lot of them. You've always supported me no matter what. You're an incredible friend, and I want what's best for you. If this guy's the one for you, then I support it. But if he breaks your heart, tell me where his car is. It's been a good few years since I used that crowbar. <laughs> Oh, of course you can have a hug. Come here. Uh, I am almost done. Tell you what. How about I finish putting all this away? And then you and I can go for some pizza. <laughs> Listen. Nothing is going to stop me from using an unholy amount of ketchup on my fries. It's just one of my quirks. If someone's going to love me, they're going to love all of me. Including my ketchup addiction. Now if you'll excuse me, I'll put this away and then I'll be right back. Are you ready to go? I was thinking about something. There's a good chance someone likes you without you even knowing it. <laughs> I'm serious. The guy you like doesn't know how you feel. So for all you know, what I'm saying might be true. Oh, is that right? You'd know if someone liked you. Hmm. I am not convinced. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You're right. You didn't specifically say you liked anyone. Merely that you wanted advice. But you never know someone might be aching to be with you. What about me? Anyone that I have my eye on? Uh, I've been through a lot. It would have to take someone pretty special to come around to get my attention. Oh no, I'm not telling you anything about my type. 
<laughs> Forget about it. Hmm. Maybe if you let me have all the ketchup I want. Maybe I'll tell you then. Come on. Let's go.